name is Sudhigya Sharma. I'm an artist. Today I'll be talking about uh, my journey with you. Uh, my father is also an artist. My father has been uh, uh, teaching a lot of people in the country in the art form. So I grew with the art form. Uh, in 2001, I kind of started my journey and I didn't want to become an artist. I actually want to become an exporter because I see my father uh, thrive so much to kind of uh, uh, be an artist to survive in the industry. It was a very good line. So I did my foreign trade export management, and uh, after that, uh, started my own export firm in 2001. So from then, uh, seven years passed by, and uh, in the journey, I I tried to make make a uh, a lot of effort to kind of make a mark and you know become an exporter. But uh, all my life, I have uh, always uh, been an artist. From my very childhood, uh, when I was seven years old, I used to uh, sit in my veranda. We used to make colors, vegetable dyes, all by self. And uh, this is like, uh, I'm 38 now. So this is like, what, 30, 31 years back. So all, so this is not something which I learned. It was kind of inherited. In 2008, I went, went to Bombay and just to kind of catch up with a couple of friends. So I uh, met uh, a, uh, somebody wanted me to do a portrait for them. So and a dear friend, he referred me to someone. That's a big, you know, he's, his father is also an artist and you, know, you should uh, get a portrait done from him. But I have been, I've not been painting uh, since like almost uh, six, seven years now. But I know you're, a, you're very good at art and you should do it. So I just took that as a, uh, you know, just like, a, you know, I'll do it for you, okay. So I did the portrait a month later when I gave them the portrait. So the lady, uh, the portrait who I did for the mother, so she demised uh, an ear back. And it was the son, the daughter-in-law, and the father. So I gave the portrait to them, and uh, the father started crying. And uh, so did the son, his daughter, uh, daughter-in-law. So, and I asked him, why are you crying? So he said that, uh, so Vicky, you kind of uh, portray your uh, emotions in such a manner that we feel that she's live here. She's live amongst us. And uh, so I was like uh, very numb. So, uh, like, uh, so he was like, uh, how much uh, would you charge me for this? So America's uh, 35,000. So he was like, uh, that's it? So I thought you will charge me a lakh for it. So I said, sir, this is, a, is that a compliment or is that a comment? So the son said that we know it doesn't look like a painting. It looks like a partash ka kaam, that intricate detail. So I've been taking care of finesse really well from the very beginning. So I like things to be precise in terms of uh, Anything what I do, do it to that caliber that uh, even I cannot replicate it again. And this was the first compliment I got as an artist. So, and then uh, post that, uh, they kind of made me meet new people. And uh, after that, the journey kind of began. The word of mouth spread so big, so big as an artist that like I, I met, uh, the next step was uh, Priyanka Chopra coming in, somebody referred me to her. And after that, the export thing just went out of the line and I kind of started doing more of the commissions, more of commissions for families. And uh, then the journey began to, uh, uh, Sachin Tendulkar met me in 2008. And for me, that was something really, really big. That was like, uh, I met him, I actually tried seeking an appointment from him to uh, you know, do some portraits for them, some paintings for them. So that was in Jaipur. Then uh, he met me, he gave me an appointment for at his house. Then post that, a uh, lot of people uh, came in, just kind of spread the word well, and uh, the chain kind of became big. And uh, in the course of the journey, so I was always striving to do shows. I wanted to do my solo shows. I wanted galleries to kind of accept um, the, you know, the traditional form of artwork, which was not happening. It was a struggle, and you used to do shows, and. There was no turning up, because like I said, the, all the Arab 
to turn to the contemporary art forms. As we all know, India is the richest, the Kohinoor, it's, it's also from the country. So we are very culture, culture rich and in the past two decades things kind of changed it to that manner and everything became very modern. Uh, to that level that people completely forgot, um, you know, the, the, the traditional forms of art, the, the thing, the charm what we grew in, there's still a Hawa Mahal, there's still a Taj Mahal. Yeah. 2017, I uh, did a portrait for the Prime Minister. So that was uh, uh, just a portrait done and sent to the PMO. It and was somebody referred that, you know, he Sharma ji hai aur bahut si painting banate hain, ab in se banwai. So, this way, the portrait went and uh, after three months down the line, there was this uh, no call ID uh, call came. So, I just took the call and uh, like, he was like, uh, Sharma ji, bol rahe hai, kaha ji? So, we were talking about PMO, so to PM to meet with you. So, I was like, uh, sorry. So, we were talking about PMO and we want to meet with you. I said, okay. So, we were next week free. Hai? So I said, yes, absolutely. So after that, I was in Bombay then. So I flew to Jaipur. Thursday we had a meeting. And we were there, you know, an hour before. So in the, uh, what do you call, there's a small waiting area, which uh, a lot of people who come and wait who have to meet the PM. So there was this uh, industrial family, a big industrial guy sitting right there. And uh, he looks at the magazine while we're waiting to meet the Prime Minister. And... Uh, so this guy looks at me and looks at the magazine. So looks at me, looks at the magazine. So I, he was like, are you up here? So I said, sir, I didn't get you. Got up, I reached him and saw the last page. Uh, the article was, uh, I did a portrait for Justin Bieber uh, when he was in the country. Uh, the magazine was uh, called The Week. So, and uh, I just reached out to him. So he said, you're a very big kalakar. Hai. Manika, sir, I don't know about that, but uh, uh, but yes, that's me, sir. Thank you. <laughs> so, we'll then uh, sat again. Then uh, at the and then the PM uh, just called uh, called me and uh, he came and hugged me like Kalapat kya painting banaye hamari aap. So I was like, thank you, sir. So we'll have to see. So he was like. Uh, uh, aap aye, uh, Betty. Then uh, he was like, Chitra kala karte hai aap. I said, yes, sir. He was like, Kalakar sir, one thing to tell you, how can we grow up in folk art? So then, uh, that is something I wanted to meet and talk. Because no one, you dream it, you zeal it, and, and actually will come to life.